everyone, Jana here with HSRA. Hope you guys are doing amazing today. We wanted to give you a few tips on staging your coffee tables. How do you do that where it's not too much, not too little? Um, if you're like us, we've got several different packages of um, staging um, that you can order through all the way from our basic essentials to our luxury. So of course the coffee table is going to look a little different. We're going to add more things to it whenever we are staging for luxury. But this is a great setup. What I love about this is we have um, a few key pieces here. We have just a tray to anchor the space and then of course a book to give a little height. Um, we have uh, two pieces here and a little bit of some scale to go upwards and it almost gives that cascade effect. So you guys can see this. Of course we put the tray on an angle and it gives a little bit of um, designer look to that. And think of a waterfall. It just kind of waterfalls down. Looks really, really nice. So that's one option that you can do. Big thing, whatever you put on the coffee table needs to be um, all the way the spherical, have something that ha you see the shape all the way around it, not something that's one dimensional like maybe a picture frame that has one main side. Because you have a conversation area here, people are going to be sitting down and it needs to look beautiful from all sides. So think about that when you are placing those items for uh, your coffee table. So one little sample here, of course the book, the blue picks up the blue in the chairs. And I've got a few more samples. If you're going for a modern look, sometimes you don't need a lot. So we literally have um, two repeating uh, pieces, just gives a little bit of dimension. If you want to keep it real clean line, that works well. You, of course, can add a little greenery to it to give the threes. Everybody loves to work in threes. That works nicely, um, but still keeps with your, um, your contemporary look. It has a repeating patterns throughout on your uh, pillows and things like that. Another nice option to do. Something simple uh, may just be a beautiful tray, right? A tray, a bowl, something that just gives, again, it's all dimensions are going to look beautiful from all sides, and it's just a power piece. So think about your power pieces. If you're going for a, mil a more minimalistic look, that's a great uh, look for you as well. If you wanted to do some balls, you want to do something else with it, but really, this is a standalone piece. And then finally, um, thinking through another piece that gives a little bit of glitz and glam. Um, it has a modern look to it. You can repeat this design when you go into your rugs or your artwork or those pillows and um, just stick with two. The great thing about pieces like this, you can mix and match those and um, it gives a nice uh, look to it. I'd probably want this a little higher with some books if you want to stack those. Um, but it looks really, really nice. So think about three to four pieces. You don't need a whole lot when you are staging your coffee tables. Same type of situation when you have your, maybe those uh, sofa tables, the consoles, um, those are the things that you want to think about. So we love to purchase pieces like this because they're large enough. We can um, put those together in a collection uh, to go on maybe a dining table or on a mantle, um, on something like a, a dresser in a master bedroom. So those are the pieces that, that are going to do multi-purpose for you. They're going to have many functions and it's just a great way to stage your properties whether you're living there or you are selling your homes. And of course, for you stagers out there building your businesses, think about the pieces that are gonna be basic essentials for your collections, your inventory as you start to grow that, that can do those multi-purposes, um, that can, you can just use them, interchange them out, and they're gonna be timeless within your inventory. And if you are a homeowner, they're great pieces that can go um, home to home with you and move and you're not going to have to, you know, re, uh, replace those very often. So I hope you've used, used these tips uh, wisely. You can use them and you can um, work with them with whatever you are in business, whether, wherever you are within your staging or your design. Um, we just love giving you guys these tips. So if you need anything else, let us know. If you'd like to see a tip on something else, uh, we're here. Just comment below um, on our YouTube channel or on our Facebook Live. Uh, we would love to hear your feedback. Thank you so much.